Hey folks, it's Herp Derp Herpetology and I am here to tell you guys the difference between an American Toad and a Fowler's Toad. Right here we have the American Toad or Bufo Americanus. And right here we have the Fowler's Toad or Bufo Fowleri. And she's very still. These are both female toads. As you can see I have them in this little terrarium that I use for feeding my animals. Let's start with the American toad. If you look at an American toad, you'll notice that she has pigmented spots on her back. Now, now with this toad she's very dark, which is very common with an American toad, so you can barely tell her pigmented spots. But if you look inside these pigmented spots, you'll notice she has maybe only one to two warts per pigmented spot. Some situations, uh, like with this one, she'll have, in some of her spots, she'll have three or four, but the big warts is what we're really focusing on. And so, in this one, she has two. In this one, she has two. In this one right here, she has two. And in this one, she has four. But normally, they'll just have one to two pigmented spots. One to, one to two warts in each pigmented spot is what I meant to say. <laughs> Alright, another way to tell if it's an American toad is if you look at their hind legs. Now this is going to be very difficult to see, but if you look at their femur and their shin, you'll notice that the warts on their shin are bigger than the warts on their femur. Alright, now let's look at the Fowler's Toad. Boy. Now this one I just found outside earlier tonight. I'm going to set it free tomorrow. Maybe. I most likely will set it free though. But you'll notice that a Fowler's Toad tends to be a lot brighter in color. And if you look at those pigmented spots, you'll see that there's a lot more, she's peeing on me, you'll see that there's a lot more warts. There tends to be from four to five warts in each one of those pigmented spots. As you can see in this one, she has four. In this one, she has five. In this one, she has four. And in this one, she has one, two, six. So that's pretty interesting. And also if you look at their hind legs, you'll notice that the warts on their shin are about the same size as the warts on their femur. I'm sorry I'm not getting the best footage, so I'm not getting the best examples, but if you look up some images on Google, um, then you'll see the differences between Fowler's toads and American toads. But yeah, those are the differences between Fowler's and American Toads. Hope this video was informative for you, and catch you guys in the next one.